okay we have three groups why don't we delete one group do you want to do that let's do that so if you want to delete a group the group should be in a inactive status right okay so let's see if a group is in active status or not so for that we'll query the v dollar log table okay and you see group 3 is in inactive status and even group 2 is in inactive status that's good okay let's delete the group 3 so for that it is alter database drop log file group 3 that's all database altered so now let's get it from the log file to see if it is deleted see you don't see 3 anymore so that means the log file group 3 is deleted now let's go and add it and adding is easy now you should know how to add it right okay let's do that alter database add log file group 3 and then you have to mention the files okay disk 2 prod 1 log redo 3a dot log and I'll mention comma and I'll mention one more file name okay disk 2 prod 1 log redo 3b dot log and let me mention one more disk 3 sorry disk 2 prod 1 log redo 3c dot log and let me close and mention the size as 10m ok it's adding ok now let's go and check the log file okay let me order by group so that you can see that clearly you see the first group has two redo log files the second one has two and the third one has three so the number of log files in each group need not be the same okay you can create one in group one maybe three in group two maybe five in group three so the number of files in each group need not be the same okay you have learnt a lot in this session right you learnt how to delete a group also you learnt how to add a group that's good